Hey, um, I'm here. Listener, where are you? You, uh, called me over. Is something wrong? You seemed very, very distraught over the phone. And I just wanted to make sure you're okay. Listener, why are you crying? What's wrong? Uh, your friend died? Uh, how? Oh, I'm sorry for your loss. That must have been a terrible feeling. I too know what it's like to lose the people who are most important in my life. So, I completely understand your pain. <sighs> Come here. Let me help you. <sighs> Just... Come here. I'll hold you in my arms. I'll comfort you. I'll do whatever it takes to help you feel better. I understand that it's tragic. Nobody wants to go through that. But that's just a part of life. Sadly, we lose the people that we care about. Death is very unavoidable. That I know. But knowing that your best friend or loved one has died, you could have at least hugged them one last time. You could have at least talked to them, spend time with them one last time. All those things you wish you could have done if you knew that it would be their final moments. No matter how they die, it's still going to be tragic. It's still going to be heartbreaking. And honestly, I really do not want to see you in pain. So I'm willing to do whatever it takes to help you get through this. I'm doing whatever it takes to make you happy, to make you feel better. I really, really do care about you, and I, I don't want to see you like this. I really don't. And honestly, I, I don't know what to say at this point. I know you're really heartbroken about this. I know it's going to take a while for you to get over this. After all, that is the impact of somebody's death. Especially if it's someone who is really important to you. It's really hard to get over that. Like, you have a hard time accepting the fact that they're gone forever. They, they'll never come back. Moved on to the afterlife. I know it's sad. And honestly... You know, listener, just know that I love you, okay? You have no idea how much I really do love you, with all my heart. <sighs> and so, I wish to stay with you. I wish to comfort you, hold you, cuddle you. Whatever it takes to make you happy, to help you get over this. I know it's a big shock to you that your closest friend is now gone. Honestly, I didn't want this for you. You didn't want this for yourself. Unfortunately, I guess it was their time. <laughs> I know it. That's the sad reality. People aren't even living up to the ripe old age. And those that do are pretty lucky. After all, this world is an unpredictable place. Also cruel. They say there's more bad than good. I honestly don't like to think that way, but... I guess I have to. I guess I have to accept this fact. I guess I have to accept the fact that the world is a cruel place. It is beautiful, but it hides its cruelty. 
What has our world become for the need to watch each other suffer? A world where the suffering doesn't end. And even if you're not suffering, somebody else in this world is. For whatever reason this may be, I don't know. Here, um, what can I do to make you feel at least a little bit better about this? It's all gonna be okay, listener, because at least you have me, and I will not leave this world without you. I promise from the bottom of my heart that we will be together until death. So, um... Do you want to put on a movie and we can cuddle on the couch? You do? Great. Let's get everything set up. <laughs> so what movie you want to watch? Okay. I love you, listener. I really do.